Hello and welcome to another episode of Daily News. Today's video is about survival statistics for lung cancer. Lung cancer survival. Find out about survival for lung cancer. People ask us for this information but not everyone with cancer wants to read it. So, if you aren't sure whether you want to know at the moment, you can come back to it later. These are general statistics based on large groups of patients. They can't tell you what will happen in your individual case. No one can tell you exactly how long you'll live with lung cancer. It depends on your individual situation, treatment and level of fitness. Your doctor can give you more information about your own outlook, prognosis. Or you can talk to the Cancer Research UK nurses on free phone 0808 800 4040 from 9 to 5, Monday to Friday. Survival for non-small cell lung cancer by stage. There are no UK-wide statistics for non-small cell lung cancer survival. The following statistics come from the 2007 Lung Cancer Staging Project. This worldwide study collected data about lung cancer on more than 81,000 patients from 19 countries. There is a range of statistics for each stage because for some patients the stage was based on the results of scans and tests, and for other patients the stage was found during surgery. Stage 1 Stage 1 non-small cell lung cancer is divided into two stages, stage 1 AM and 1 B. For stage 1 AM non-small cell lung cancer, between 58 and 73 out of every 100 people, 58% to 73%, will survive for 5 years or more after diagnosis. For stage 1B non-small cell lung cancer, between 43 and 58 out of every 100 people, 43% to 58%, will survive for 5 years or more after they are diagnosed. Stage 2 Stage 2 non-small cell lung cancer is also divided into stage 2AM and 2B. For stage 2AM non-small cell lung cancer, between 36 and 46 out of every 100 people, 36% to 46%, will survive for 5 years or more with treatment. For stage 2B non-small cell lung cancer, between 25 and 36 out of every 100 people, 25% to 36%, will survive for 5 years or more after they are diagnosed. Stage 3 Stage 3 non-small cell lung cancer is divided into stage 3AM and stage 3B. For stage 3AM non-small cell lung cancer, between 19 and 24 out of every 100 people, 19% to 24%, will survive for 5 years or more after they are diagnosed. For stage 3B non-small cell lung cancer, between 7 and 9 out of every 100 people diagnosed, 7% to 9%, will survive for 5 years or more after they are diagnosed. Stage 4 For stage 4 non-small cell lung cancer, only between 2 and 13 out of every 100 people, 2% to 13%, will survive for 5 years or more after diagnosis. It can seem illogical for stage 3B cancer to have 5-year survival rates from 7% to 9% and stage 4 from 2% to 13%. This is because the staging system only looks at the extent of the cancer. It does not look at the specific types of cancer. So the stage 4 group may include more people who have slowly growing cancers or cancer that responds very well to particular treatments than the stage 3 group. Survival for small cell lung cancer by stage. There are non-UK wide statistics for small cell lung cancer survival. The following statistics also come from the International 2007 Lung Cancer Staging Project. This study used the TNM staging system to give the following statistics about survival based on the stage found by scans and tests. The project included more than 8,000 patients with small cell lung cancer. Stage 1 Stage 1 small cell lung cancer is divided into stage 1 AM and 1 B. For stage 1 AM small cell lung cancer, almost 40 out of every 100 people, almost 40%, will survive for 5 years or more after diagnosis. For stage 1 B small cell lung cancer, around 20 out of every 100 people, around 20%, 
will survive for five years or more after they are diagnosed. Stage 2 Stage 2 small cell lung cancer is also divided into stage 2 AM and 2 B. For stage 2 AM small cell lung cancer, almost 40 out of every 100 people, almost 40%, will survive for five years or more after they are diagnosed. For stage 2B small cell lung cancer, almost 20 out of every 100 people, almost 20%, will survive for 5 years or more after diagnosis. The survival rates for stage 2AM seemed to be higher than for stage 1B. Researchers think this is because the study had very few patients in the stage 2AM group. They suggest that those statistics may not be so reliable as the others. Stage 3 Stage 3 is divided into stage 3AM and stage 3B. For stage 3AM small cell lung cancer, almost 15 out of every 100 people, almost 15%, will survive for 5 years or more after they are diagnosed. For stage 3B small cell lung cancer, around 10 out of every 100 people, around 10%, will survive for 5 years or more after diagnosis. Stage 4 for stage 4 small cell lung cancer, only about 1 out of every 100 people, 1%, will survive for 5 years or more after diagnosis. Read more about the stages of lung cancer. Thanks a lot for watching. Please subscribe to our channel for daily videos.